Hi guys, it's Anaya and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome back to episode 14 of Freestyle Drawing Friday. I just want to welcome all newcomers to the channel, so hi. I'm Anaya and every Friday I freestyle draw. Also, don't forget to check out my channel merch. Link will be in the description. I have things like hydro flasks, stickers, and shirt pins, so go check that out. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video, y'all. And let me know down in the comments below, what would you like me to draw next? So today I decided to, um, yes, you guessed it, draw my eye. I really wanted to challenge myself and see if I can draw it in a limited amount of time. Which you know me, I love challenges. So if you guys challenge me to do anything, I'm gonna take on the challenge. At least one way or another. So without further ado, that's enough talking. Relax, grab some snacks, and let's get straight into this video. So I always start out with this nice outline of the eye. So the reason why I start out with an outline of the eye, it just gives me those basic proportions of the eye. And then later I'll start going in with like all the nice details and stuff. By the way, I wanted to put this Freestyle Drawing Friday in real time so you guys can see how I draw my eye in the actual minutes it's used to actually draw this eye. I just said the same thing twice, that's so funny. So I did a poll on my channel to see how much of my art crew is actually artists. And it was so interesting to see like the different dynamic. So some of you guys are actually artists, but not only that, you guys are artists and some want to be artists and some just love art. And I honestly love that so much because it teaches the lesson of you don't have to be an artist to enjoy art. No matter if you're an artist or not, I'm just happy you guys are a part of the art crew. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Okay, now let's get back to this eye. So I outlined the shadow and the eye because I think that it gives it a little bit more 2D type look and it doesn't look as flat. And right now, I know you guys are probably thinking like, you know, what's going on? This eye don't look like an eye yet. Trust the process. I promise you it's gonna turn out really, really good. I'm really gonna have to stop drawing eyes and painting eyes because they always scare me in some type of way because they're so realistic they scare me sometimes does this ever happen to y'all let me know so we're about like three minutes in and I already have like the basic shape down and shaded in the eye this video helps me as well because I can look back and know how to get a little bit faster. The under eye wrinkle is like one of my favorite parts to draw only because it just makes it look like chef's kiss, you know? It just ties everything together in the most realistic way. Okay, I know what you guys are gonna say. Whoa, 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 whoa. Anaya, why are you using a mechanical pencil? Because despite the mechanical pencil controversy that I made, I actually really like mechanical pencils, so. <laughs> yeah. Go. 
going with the lines or the wrinkles of my face i try to like create those wrinkles they're not really link wrinkles they're probably like eye folds maybe what do you call them eyelid folds how about eye closures is that a word i'm pretty sure that's not a thing but we're gonna roll with it for the sake of the description of this video Okay, so I have a question. What if you guys just turned around and saw this beautiful eye staring at you? Like you just turn around and you just see like a huge eye. That would literally be startling. Okay, back to the video. <laughs> Okay, so you guys probably can't see it from my screen, but I do have these little moles. And they're actually pretty noticeable. So here you see me taking a second to lower the brightness on my screen, because I just now found out that my screen had a glare. So, yeah. So moving on to this beautiful eyebrow of mine. Yes, yes. Now, honestly, doing eyebrows aren't as simple as they look. Some people actually make eyebrows look so, so easy, but it's the way that you put them that counts. So here, it's probably not my best eyebrow, but it, it, it's pretty much okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, the laugh cut off is really getting me right now. Like, <laughs> I just can't. I'm telling y'all, sometimes I just be laughing at myself over these voiceovers. Like, one voiceover could make me laugh so much. Okay, so the eyelashes always start off good at first. And then sometimes I just be making a line too dark. But this time, it's not really bad. I actually like the eyelashes this time. So right now I'm just brushing up on some details of the eyes, doing my last little inspection. And then I want to branch out from the eye corner and I want to create one of the shadows that is depicted in the image. So I'm not working with a pointed eraser so I can't get those perfect defined um, highlights. But you see here, I'm trying to make it work. It's about using what you have and being innovative, okay? So now moving on to the nose bridge and by doing so I want to make sure that I bring out the skin make sure it knows where the nose meets otherwise the picture is gonna look kind of wonky so 
some of you guys were asking me for blend tips and some of that is kind of like showcased in this video however if you want a separate video on how i shade my pictures or my drawings uh just let me know because i have plenty tips and tricks i use to blend my drawings So since I'm extra, I decided to put like the little dots on my eyeballs. That pretty much counts as realism, doesn't it? <laughs> so I would like to say now, if you made it to the end of this video, thank you guys for watching so, 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 so much. Thank you guys for the love and the support on my art videos. I well appreciate it. Stay tuned for the next Freestyle Drawing Friday, y'all. P.S. I do this every Friday. So with that being said, here's the results, and I'm out. Uh, bye bye.